thank you all so much for everything. Thank you for coming out here. Thank you for everybody who has had a hand in building this barn. Thank you, Mom. I love you. I love you too! <laughs> And I just am very thankful that all of this has been put together so beautifully. And I just appreciate everybody coming out here. And I really hope everyone has enjoyed themselves. Are you enjoying yourselves? Yeah. Really? Really? That's how much you're enjoying yourselves? Yeah? Yeah? I want to hear some screams. Come on. Woo! Thank you. <laughs> um, I'm Ash Ann. I'm the oldest daughter of Chisholm's. Um, thanks for being here, and uh, I'm going to sing a few songs, a few of them are originals, uh, the first one is not, but the next three will be, and then the next one won't be, and then the next one will be, and then the next one won't be, okay? <laughs> Alright, um, okay. Can you hear that? I play lightly. There you go. All right. <laughs> one's an original. It's called Huckleberry Mountain. Um, I had uh, been playing this song for a while and I kind of used the music as improv, as improv, you know, so that I could just play whatever to it. Um, but every single time I would play the music, I would want to play something about a mountain. And um, I climbed a rock called Strawberry Rock in Trinidad, North Carolina, on my, or I'm sorry, North California, on my travels. And um, it was beautiful, it was absolutely beautiful up there. And uh, along the way, I just discovered what huckleberries were, and they're really good little fruits. Um, but I just discovered what they were, so I was eating huckleberries the entire way up, and when I finally climbed Strawberry Rock, there was a huckleberry bush right on top, and it kind of gave me the inspiration for this song. It's called Huckleberry Mountain. Yeah. 
younger I saw a picture um, of a little boy and it was on TV and they were asking for money to send to um, I believe it was South Africa to help these kids and feed them and nourish them and stuff like that so they're asking for money and they showed this picture of this little boy and he was wearing water bottles as shoes and he just had the biggest smile on his face. He was so happy. And it really, I had that picture in my mind for many, many years. And it just, it, it reminded me that even if the times are hard, you still are able to keep a smile on your face. And sometimes you have to s accept the situations that come to you and experience your life in love no matter what happens. So, I wrote a song about this little guy. It's called Hope. Oh, Ashley! Thank you! <sighs> Memory for 
when we do like us he has a sister a mother brother and best friend daddy gone to work When on the ashes fell from the sky and rain Rarely touched his lips, he watched his young torn apart And everything he ever worked for, lost forever But only physically, he smiled knowingly That there was more to come From this he had hope it would all be done and so Soon, a quiet, cold bitterness made up his surroundings. Walking on crushed water bottles, what would he give up next? Light boys smile Soft and very sweet He extended his challenges Hard but well Worth it Nothing was a gift so that in his eyes all his cry tears no longer can hide from fear when on the ashes fell from sky and rain Rarely touched his lips He watched his town torn apart And everything he ever worked for Lost forever But only physically He smiled knowingly That there was more to come From this he had hoped It would all be done And it's over Soon Yeah. What's my time right now? Don't know. Okay. Well, you've been up to 13 Four. minutes and 57 seconds. Uh, okay. <laughs> All right. Um, if you guys have heard of Passenger, the song is called Patient Love. Um, it's one of my favorites. And I've uh, just recently learned this one, so forgive me if I mess up on it. <laughs> Oh, 
picture in my wallet I'm not gonna tear it up, I'm not gonna spoil it Sing an unspoken heartbreak, a heartbroken handshake I take with me where I go Three words at the tip of my tongue Not to be spoken or sung or whispered to anyone Till I'm screaming at the top of my lungs again Sorry, I am like really nervous right now. I just want to let you guys know. I'm like really nervous right now. I don't know why. Thank you. <laughs> I'm just going to end though. <laughs> it was a new one that I was learning, so you know. You'll get it next time. This will be my last song. Um, it's another one that I wrote, and it's called Interconnected. Ooh. Mm -hmm. 